Good morning, welcome back to another vlog. I am straightening my hair on a super humid day. I never really straighten my hair anymore just because, wow, I'm ready for fall. I'm ready for fall and to not be super pregnant in this heat, but I am straightening my hair today. I also made a yogurt bowl. So I've got strawberry yogurt with some strawberries, chocolate chips, and granola. I'm gonna be having this. And today's video is all about like taking care of yourself, self-care, and speaking of taking care of yourself, mentally and physically, thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. I have worked with them in the past. And basically, BetterHelp is a therapy platform that connects you with therapists. So I really strongly believe in therapy and it doesn't matter who you are i believe anyone can benefit from therapy and talking to someone and getting all of your emotions out i know me i am 36 weeks pregnant um, and i've been going through it mentally and i know i'm going to go through it postpartum it's going to be it's going to be crazy but it's going to be fine and i do believe that if you talk to someone and communicate i think it will just make you such a better person i've worked with them in the past but better help is really nice because it is remote, it's very easy to use their online platform, and you don't have to go in and have an appointment in person. So sometimes finding a therapist can literally take months and you'll just be waiting for that appointment. This is all remote, it's online, you can be over the phone, you can be in a chat, makes it super easy to do. So it's not only very affordable, but it's very accessible as well to everyone. It's also super easy to sign up and get matched with a therapist. And if you don't connect with a therapist, you can just request a new one, which I actually have done that a couple of times. So when I was doing it, I did, um, I did switch therapists, but it was just super easy to do that too. So with these pregnancy hormones and with my postpartum hormones, I'm gonna be probably wanting to talk to someone um, just because it's a crazy time. Anyone who is a mother out there, let me tell you, it's not a bad thing, but we all need therapy, okay? These toddlers, these little ones, oh my God, wow, they take a toll on us. They really, really do. They try it, don't they? It's not just women, it's men too, it's couples. I think it could make so many relationships a lot stronger. So I'm gonna link BetterHelp down below. And I also have a 10% off coupon that you can use for your first month of BetterHelp. I'm someone who doesn't like going in and like talking to someone anyways. So I would much rather do it like over a chat, you know? So if I'm out of breath, I'm sorry. It's just the 36 weeks pregnancy in me. So again, I will link BetterHelp down below. And I'm gonna be having this and we're gonna have a self-care day. I do believe in taking care of yourself physically and mentally. So I'm gonna be getting a lot of like postpartum things today that I really want, um, like body products, just things to make me feel good physically and mentally. And I just feel like when I smell good, when I have like good body scrub, but good body products, hair things, all that, wow, I'm a much better person. I'm in a much better mood, you know? So that's what we're gonna do today and Good morning. So this morning we are doing some self-care shopping. Someone pulled up directly next to me. Um, we're going to do some self-care shopping this morning. So I don't know. I want like maybe body products, maybe a candle, something that would make me feel better postpartum. That is the goal here. Also, I straighten my hair. It is impossible to straighten your hair in this humidity. So I won't probably be doing that again, but let's go find some things. I'm getting a coffee first because priorities. Another soap bar. Okay, we got the coffee. Brown sugar shake and espresso vanilla cold foam. Look at how cute these are. Cake pop. And you got a cake pop. Good. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Look at how cute these are. I've never seen these. Matte greens and glowy vitamin C. We have Oakley pointed out this. Oh, this is actually a sponge. Doesn't that look cool though? Yeah. It's hard. I think we could rub this on our body or face. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah, you wanna get it? Well, we'll see. Okay, so I wanted a sugar scrub. Ooh, okay. I think I want vanilla because I don't think you can go wrong with a vanilla one. And postpartum, I just feel like I'm gonna be over the lemon and I'm gonna be into like the vanilla sweetness. 
So we're gonna do this one. I haven't gotten these sponges in so long, but I really like them. You okay? Yeah. Okay. I really like those sponges. I don't necessarily need them right now though. Okay, I heard this primer was really good. Power Grip Primer from oh, Elf. Yeah. All done, so I'm gonna get yeah. this. Snacks? Okay. Stop, you're gonna fall out of the cart. You're gonna fall and get a no. big boo-boo. No. Yeah, you might. No. I kinda want one of these. No. My cellar water. No. What is your issue? Should I get this? You smelling it? Gentle peeling water. What do you mean peeling? I don't think I want peeling. I want cleansing. Yellow one. You think I should get the yellow? You want to hold on to it for mama? Yeah. Thank you. I forgot they had these loops masks. I'm going to get one. Let's. Okay, this one's glow, rejuvenate, detoxify. Let's do the glow. Yeah. We're gonna do this. Don't be putting your mouth on it. Are you crazy? They have all of the pumpkin candles out. Which I'm ready for fall. But I don't know if I'm ready for like the pumpkin spice, you know? Like it's just too, I think pumpkin spice is like too pumpkin-y for me. Too spicy. Okay, we're over here at the Hearth and Hand collection of candles, and this one smells so good, but it's autumn cider. So again, we're getting into like the fall. I mean, it smells really good though. And then cashmere and suede. Oh, I really like this one. I really, really do. This one's just like a cozy scent. How much is the small one? $6.99? She's expensive, but she's so cute. These are also really cute. Do I need this? What are these ones? Oh, that smells, I think, the same. Are these the same? I also like the tin ones. Ones that look like this. This one is meadow. This one's fine. Herbs. Fine. I really like this cashmere one. Cashmere and suede. Okay, Willow also smells really good. I like this one too for like a bathroom scent. I also like this plant. That's cute. We have reached the food and there's nothing like cinnamon rolls. That's like self-care, right? Do I need them? Probably not. Yeah, I'll give you a snack. Okay, this is the prettiest thing ever. I love this, this is $10. I like all of the things right here, right now. It's a little bit fall, but it's not like over the top. These mini bowls for ice cream. <gasps> honey pot with dipper. Does anyone actually use like honey like that? Even these are really cute. We need an oven mitt. But I like that style better. These are so pretty. Oh. Yeah, it is yellow. Rifle Paper Company. No, you don't think I should get those? No, my But they're so pretty. No. No. Okay. You're telling me to stop. Okay, I'll put it back over here. But these are so nice. Honey flower with shea butter. This little razor shower hook for the shower. That's cute. Ooh, this one. Ooh. No, no, no. Why can't I get a razor, honey? Maybe I need one. No, my Are you serious? No. <laughs> all right, sit down. No. Let's yeah, see, look at all this lotion. Jesus. No. Look at all this lotion, honey. No. All right, listen. We gotta be nice here. Oh my. Two-year-old, am I right? No, no. What did mama get you? Do so you have to be super nice, right? Mama's not great at bending down. Okay, I'll put it back. Maybe. Ooh, but what's this? The Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Wash. Never heard of this brand. Ooh, Niacinamide Serum Body Wash. Balances, soothes, and replenishes moisture. These are intriguing. I've never heard of this brand. And I have heard of 
salt hair, salt air. <laughs> Ooh, these are big. Oh my god, I used to be obsessed with this last pregnancy. Do I need it? I can't smell it. No, I don't need it. I think I'm gonna get this Method Body Coconut Rice Milk Shea Butter for postpartum. Let's make ourselves feel better, right? I really need a new mouthwash, but I didn't love this one. They're actually out of the one that I really liked. No. Should I, I should not get this? What? The baby was crying. What do you think was wrong with the baby? They got a big boo-boo? Uh-oh. They probably got a big boo-boo from standing up in the car. You should sit so you don't get a big boo-boo. Okay. Thanks, baby. Okay, I just saw this one though and it's just like too pretty to let go. I feel like everyone has this, like literally everyone. This is a really tiny container for $30. It's <laughs> super tiny. I mean, you probably just need like a scoop, but why is it 30 doll hairs for this size? I mean, maybe it's delicious and probably really good for you. I was looking for the Hum new gummies that they came out with that has like chlorophyll in it and a couple other things like green celery, but I don't see them. I don't know if they'd be here or somewhere else. Okay, I know I don't need this like right away, but like sculpt and de bloat. Ooh, that looks good, doesn't it? Yeah. I don't need this right away. I just need like protein, but eventually. I definitely don't need any more makeup, but look at this palette. This one's really, really pretty from ColourPop. I love that. These are so cheap too. What are you getting? You want to show them? Yeah. Okay, show them. Turn it around so they can see it. What is it? Marshall Chase. Marshall Chase? Yeah. Cool. I want to get this, but I don't think I'm going to get it today. But it's the Kopari Rose Gold Sun Shield SPF 45. This looks so pretty. The yellow one, honey. If you can't tell, Oakley's favorite color is yellow. This one is pretty, but it's 39 doll hairs. This? I think I have that. We don't a butterfly on my car flying around. Okay, I'm so embarrassing. I literally was just in the checkout area and um, I dropped a glass jar of pizza sauce and it broke, splattered everywhere. I said I was sorry like 25 times, but I felt really bad and it was also like embarrassing and I could feel myself like starting to sweat, you know? Um, so I'm like, that was embarrassing. But it's fine because we got like a ton of self-care stuff. I ended up getting pretty much everything I was going to but I didn't get another jar of pizza sauce, so we're gonna have to get that. All right, let's do a little self-care haul. First of all, this to me is self-care. So I got the big one because they didn't have a small one of the Caramel Macchiato International Delight Creamer. I got iced coffee. I've been just, I've been really hot drinking hot coffee in the morning when it's 79 degrees in here when you first wake up. So I decided to get the iced coffee. We don't, we don't have an ice maker, so I think I'm gonna get like the ice cube tray thing. So I got those. And then I got this for postpartum, or for now, I'll probably save it for postpartum. Method Body Coconut Rice Milk Shea Butter Simply Nourish. They had a ton of these, and I wanted to give it a try. So got that. I got the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. I don't know, I think this is new, unless they did like new packaging. I'm not sure, but it looked good, so. Wanted to give that a go. I got the Loops mask. Okay, really excited about this. And then I ended up getting this, even though Oakley did not want me to get this. But this is the Deluxe Smooth Sensitive Venus Razor. And this is the Rifle Paper Company collaboration. Look at how pretty that is. So I was like, absolutely I need razors, of course. When do I not? So I got that. This was on clearance for $5.09. Not the best deal because it's usually $5.99, but we needed new ones. This is Hibiscus and Blooming Orchids. Really pretty. I got the Vanilla Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub. So I got that for postpartum. I'm just going to be a vanilla and coconut girly like after having a baby. A baby. So I just know me. Like I'm not going to clean anymore. It's, it's a done deal. I'm not like right now. I could breathe this down, but after, oh no, honey, no. 
And then also I got this for Oakley. Um, this is play sand. It says ages four plus, but it's fine. So I just thought he would have fun with this. I've been trying to do like more activities with him and have more fun with him before the baby comes because I don't know, because he's just like my only little sweet boy right now. And we're literally having a baby in a matter of like two weeks. So um, yeah, I just want to do more fun things with him. But anyways, that's my little Target haul, my little self-care haul. And now I'm gonna clean and yeah, back in my cleaning era. I wish this was a little bit more organized because it's definitely not right now. Um, but a couple of you asked me what snacks I give Oakley and oh, I got these at Target today too. Sorry, distracted. Favorite day, chocolate dipped peanut butter cookies. Okay, these are for me and Scott, but mainly me. Okay, so for snacks, he's a gummy boy, okay? Fruit snacks are not the best, but it's like what he eats. I'm like, how do these toddlers survive and live off of eating gummies and a chip a day? You know what I mean? Like, he doesn't usually eat meals. He's having a grilled cheese with tomatoes right now and pineapple and a fruit bar, but like, usually... It, he just wants snacks, snacks, snacks. So he will eat gummies and popsicles. <sighs> Listen, whatever, it is what it is. Also Annie's mac and cheese, like anything with like pasta, he likes pasta noodles, he likes pasta salad. I got these Pop-Tarts, but I got them for me and I know Pop-Tarts are not, they're not good, okay? They're not good, let's just admit it. But I mean, I was craving them for some reason. Let's blame it on the pregnancy. I also got these and I was gonna do little mini pizzas with them, but I dropped the pizza sauce in the checkout aisle and got glass on my toe and splattered and... <sighs> Listen, are you one of those people that when you're embarrassed, your face turns red? Because for me, it's on fire. My, my face turns so red. Um, anyways, these bars, these are actually really healthy, you know? Might be one of the only things that's healthy that I get, but Oakley loves these. It's called That's It, and it has an apple and mango. They have different flavors. Oakley really likes these bars, so we get those. I have Nutri-Grain bars. He usually takes it, goes into a room, and like crumbles it in the corner. Maybe that's just a toddler thing. And he also likes veggie straws. Also, English muffins with butter, he likes that. And then our fridge, I do have to organize it again. I need to do like a deep, deep, deep clean and like organize with me before the baby comes, but he really likes tangerines, so I do tangerines. The yogurt's mainly for me and Scott. He likes these go-go squeeze applesauces, but he also likes yogurt. He's obsessed with pineapple, so I got pineapple for him. Um, yeah, I gotta organize this. He likes strawberries, so I got strawberries. And then I did get this at Target today. These are kind of pricey, but he likes these because they're just like easy and crackers, you know? So I hate this. <laughs> Does anyone else's like significant other wrap like a piece of cheese or a small onion or whatever in tin foil and just like put it in a ball and just go like, no. Oh, we were gonna make zucchini boats, but this one looks like it's on its way out. Yeah, I got part of my like calendar. I'm not gonna show you my monthly one, but my weekly planner. Some house projects. Um, I do stress tests two times a week for baby. We go to the pool a lot. We got the wallpaper, wallpaper delivery yesterday, so we're gonna do that this weekend. Oh boy. And then I have a hair appointment um, this weekend. Too. Okay, I've got you guys, whoa, can I talk? I have you guys set up on the window. I hope you guys can't hear that iPad because it's very annoying to me. <laughs> but anyways, I wanted to clean up a little bit. I also wanted to show you this because Michaela brought me this the other day. She's like the best. She just like leaves me random things on my doorstep all the time. And I'm like, you can't get a better friend than that, honestly. But Dr. Teal's Shea Sugar Scrub Prebiotic Lemon Balm. So she knows I've been into the lemon right now. I've been using this in the shower. <sighs> Delightful. Also, I went to the dermatologist again. I feel like I go to the dermatologist. Like, I feel like I live at the dermatologist. I go there a lot. But I basically got over 100 things removed off my body. And my back was like chocolate chips. It was just like a galaxy of chocolate chips. And she blasted all of the moles on my back. 
she got rid of my skin tags because for some reason, come here, sweet boy. You being nice to Teddy? For some reason, like the last week, I have gotten so many skin tags on my neck and chest. And I'm like, I was trying to remove them myself and I was like, no, I gotta go in. So she got rid of all of them for me. I mean, now they're like little mini scabs, so they still look like I have them, but they will heal. And um, I had some under my armpit, had some on my boobs, like it's a hormonal thing. So pregnancy does weird things to your body and it always, it has for me. Um, but yeah, I gotta check on him, but just wanted to say the dermatologist, yeah, she's like, well, she's great. And so is Michaela for getting me this. I'm almost out of it. Not really, I have half. But this is like the best. Oakley, come here, smell this. This is like a zesty lemon. Smell this. Smell it. Ew. <laughs> Ew. You got your mouth on it? Oh. Is it yucky? You're supposed to eat it. Oh, it does smell like you can eat it, but anyways. Is it still yucky? Come here. Ew. You're supposed to smell it. Can I have a kiss on the lips? No, I can't. No. Is it yucky in your mouth? Yeah. Okay. You know what I was looking for at Target and I didn't find? I was looking for toenail press-ons and that might be like when, I, when they first came out with that, I was like, oh, that's, that's super weird. No, I'm here for it because my toenails are in rough shape and I just need toenail press-ons. So I was looking at Target and I could not find them, but I'm pretty sure it said they had them. So maybe I just wasn't looking in the right spot, but that I have to get, I feel like, before baby. And then like I said, I'm gonna get my nails done one more time before baby. I actually was supposed to have a nail appointment tonight and I canceled it because I was like, oh, I think I can make it until like a couple days before baby. I think that should be fine. I actually woke up at 5.30 this morning, took a shower, washed my hair, blow dried it, straightened it. The straightening didn't work out, but I remember there was a point where I used to wake up before Oakley all the time and get things done and like drink my coffee and just, you know, have that me time. And I just think it's super important. And as hard as it is to get up in the morning before anyone else in your household, even though you're super tired, I just think it's like really important to do that because then you're setting your day up for success. Because I strongly believe that you can only be the best parent if you're good to yourself, I don't know how to word it, but like you can only be your best self if you are the best to yourself. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Like take care of yourself first basically because then you'll be better towards the people around you. I still don't know how to say it, but you probably get my drift. I've said it before. So anyways, it set up my day for success other than me dropping that pizza jar sauce in the target lot. Listen, I'm a clum clumsy person. Slippery hands. I'm slippery. I'm sweaty. We're getting a couch. Side note, we're getting a couch and it is going to be delivered, but it's not going to be here until after the baby. <sighs> it's not my dream couch, I'll tell you that, but it's definitely, you know, we need a couch, so. I've got a hold. He is not. He's so cute, but listen. Listen to mama. This package is like really important to mama. That's your baby sister's wallpaper. Dad is gonna set that up this weekend. That's gonna be so fun, huh? You ready for a nap soon? Anyways, um, where was I going? I don't know what I was saying, honestly. What was I saying? Oh, we're getting a couch. It's not being delivered right away. It's not my dream couch, but it is a, it's a nice couch. 
and um, finally we'll be able to sit like on a bigger space, you know? Chase and Sky? Chase Sky, Chase Sky. Yeah, it's this. Oh, you want to take him for a nap? Mm -hmm. Come here. Ask the camera. Ask them. Nap. <laughs> Can we take this for a nap? Yeah. Have you been a good boy? Yeah. Give him a kiss on your lips. All right, I guess we can take it for a nap. That one. No, just one of them. Just no. one. You pick the one. You pick which one, not both. <sighs> okay, I have to put them down for a nap. I asked on my Instagram stories. Yes, I'm blotting my sweat. I'm not sure, baby. I asked on my Instagram stories, but when did your toddler stop napping? Because I've had people in my life saying like two they're done like but then i also know people in my life that literally their baby still sleeps or their toddler still sleeps at three four i'm pushing this i am pushing this nap because when he naps he naps so well he really does some days it's harder for him to go to sleep but i'm pushing for this nap until he's Good morning. It is the next day. I just came back from my doctor's appointment a little while ago. I had my 36 week growth scan on baby girl. Now we all know this baby has been measuring big the whole time, right? Well, I just want you to take a guess real quick what you think the baby weighs right now at 36 weeks. Okay, I'll give you a second. I'll give you a second to think about it. Now, the average weight of a baby at 36 weeks is between five and six pounds. This baby is estimated eight pounds, two ounces. Here we go. Um, she's a big baby. We saw her rolls. She has chunky rolls. I'm like, oh my God, a chunky little baby. I can't even handle it. Anyways, I don't have too much longer. I'm not gonna tell you guys like when I'm going in because I am getting a C-section, but I don't have too much longer. So I'm not going to 40 weeks, if that's what you're wondering. Let me have a little sippy sippy water. I'm making Oakley some Annie's mac and cheese, even though it is sweltering hot. And I know I keep saying how hot it is in here. Guess what? We're finally doing something about it today. We're getting two more ACs. These are very powerful. It's, ACs are expensive, but you know what? We were sitting, you want more strawberries? We were sitting in our living room last night and it was 83 degrees. And we, all three of us were just miserable, cranky, agitated. We were like, the heat is literally affecting us mentally. I'll get you some more sweets. So, I'm picking up ACs after Oakley's nap. I'm going to get two, a portable one, like a stand-up one, and then one for Oakley's room. I can't do it anymore, I really can't. Um, just 83, and you know what? A newborn is supposed to be in 68 to 72 degrees, like inside. Um, honey, it's 83. Like, this baby, we, we, we all would just be like, this is way too hot, you know? Anyways, that's an update on baby. She's a big girl. Your baby sister's big. She might be even bigger than you. Like when you were born. If you don't know, Oakley was born at 37 weeks and he was seven pounds, 12 ounces. I know the estimates can be off, but um, we'll see. Okay, I'm making mac and cheese and sweating, so. Okay, so I just got Oakley down for his nap. I'm hoping he sleeps for like two hours so I can get some things done. I want to edit this vlog. I just cleaned the kitchen and I'm gonna do some laundry. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I'm going to link BetterHelp again down below in the description box with my 10% off coupon code. That will get you 10% off your first month. I think I have to clean this mirror. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.